Digital anchor Rachel Ramsey joins us now from the NBC 4 i Digital Center. She has a look at the stories making headlines online this morning. Good morning, Rachel. Hey, good morning, Matt. Now, Ohio is leading several other states in asking the U.S. Supreme Court to block a new Environmental Protection Agency rule. The court heard arguments for Ohio versus EPA, an emergency petition by Ohio, Indiana, and West Virginia to postpone implementing the Good Neighbor Plan. Introduced by the EPA last year, that's required 23 upwind states to reduce emissions that affect air quality in downwind states. Now, Ohio and 20 other states responded to the EPA by submitting their own plans outlining their methods to comply with the new proposed regulations. However, the EPA rejected all proposals for failing to include any changes to their emissions plans. For more on the story, just go to NBC4i.com. Also trending, a drive-in sign at the center of a community initiative to save it has been restored. The sign has returned to the former location of TJ's Country Place in Clintonville, which is now the future site of a Chick-fil-A. Now, originally built as part of Jerry's Drive-In in 1961, Chick-fil-A decided to incorporate the sign and made some revisions to it. Now, efforts to save the sign started just three years ago when TJ's announced it was leaving the space. A Clintonville resident then launched a petition to save the sign receiving over 2,400 signatures. Of course, for additional information, you can go to our website. And Lion Cubs Cookies opening a second Central Ohio storefront. The shop will mark its new location on North High Street in Worthington with a grand opening party at noon on March 8th. Guests will receive a free cookie and the first 100 in line will be gifted a goodie bag. The new location joins the cookie shop's first spot in Grandview Heights, which opened back in 2021. You can't go wrong with Lion Cubs Cookies, especially even their chocolate chip. Oh. I mean, Rachel, they're so good. You have to they're like cut so them in half good. or in quarters, though, because there's so much sugar. Well, yeah, <laughs> but like, I mean, it's cookies. Oh, no, you know? trust me. You can't go wrong with a cookie. It's, it's a guilty pleasure. Exactly. It very much is. Yeah. All right. Thank you very much, Rachel. And for the latest news, weather and sports 24-7, make sure you visit NBC4i.com. You can also stay connected while you're on the go with our free NBC4 News app. Don't let that today in your Apple Google Play Store.